Hello everybody and welcome to another Boss Tutorials video. It's Matt here from Boss Tutorials and today, this was requested in the last video, I'm just going to be showing you some of the multiplayer commands that you can do as the runner of the server. So nobody else can do this, only the person that is running the server, so only the person that has this terminal open. Now, if you are super confused right now, you don't know what a server is, you want one, you don't know how to make one, just go to my last tutorial, um, and I show everything, I show you how to do it. It's really basic, guys, and, uh, yeah, so this one's just gonna be some stuff. Now, the comment, it was asking, uh, to get multiplayer commands and everything, to get free items, and, you know, all the stuff that you want to you can do some pretty cool stuff with it so I'm just gonna be showing you some right now so minecraft's laggy because I'm running the screen recorder with it <laughs> but yeah alright now one thing that you will definitely need to know for the multiplayer commands is the give command now the give command uh, gives a player items uh, so, I'm just going to show you. Now, you can't type in the name of the item like you can in single player commands. The mod, uh, you have to know the number. So, I have a picture. Oops, where is it? There we go. See, a picture. Now, you probably can't read them, but it's a picture of all the Minecraft items and all their numbers next to them. Alright, so, now that I have this going, I'll go back to game. Alright, so I am going to give myself, let's see, okay, yeah, I'm just going to, just for the example, you know, you can do much bigger stuff than this, but I'm just going to give myself some wooden planks. So, you can also, you can do anything, you can do diamonds, diamond blocks, you know, anything, and it's kind of fun to mess with, but I'm going to do wooden planks, so I'm going to type in give, so you're doing this inside terminal, inside uh, the server, give, space, and then the name of the person, so um, I am super awful cow, the name of my other YouTube account, uh, and then I'm going to say 5, which is the item number, that's wooden planks, and then space, and then the amount that you want. Uh, you can't do more than 64, so I'll just do 64. Back to game, there it is, 64 wooden planks right in front of me. Alright. Now in my server, I play in a server with lots of other guys, um, and we have a rule that you aren't well, I'm not allowed to spawn stuff for them. We're not allowed to spawn things. We're not allowed to use any of the multiplayer commands. So I gotta burn this. I know it's a shame. <laughs> but, alright. Oops. Hello. Okay. So that's the give command. Now, another one. If you want to know all the commands, guys, you. I know I won't have time to explain all of them. Just type in help in the terminal. It gives you all of the commands that you can do. So in the game, if you want to say something as the administrator, just say, say, and then I'm just going to say hi. And then in the game, it says server said hi. So that's, I don't know why that's useful. If you can just play the game, but anyways. Uh, if you want to talk to everybody in the server, that's a good way of doing it. Game mode. Okay, this one's very important. I'll just show you what it does. So, there's in Minecraft, there's three different game modes. There is uh, survival, uh, creative, and there is hardcore. So, um... Yeah, so zero is... Uh, I think zero is survival, and one is creative. I might be wrong, but I'm just going to try it out. So, change the game mode, you type in game mode, space, player's name, 
and then space, and then the number of the mode. So I think that one is creative. So I'll just try it out. Yep, I was right. All right, so now. Okay, so now I can fly around and stuff because I'm in creative mode. I also have unlimited blocks to build with. So, see the stone here. You know, see the number never goes down. It says 64, but it stays there. Now, again, I'm not allowed to do that in the server, but you see there. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, creative mode. And then you want to change back to survival again. And just go to game, whoops, game mode super off account or whatever your name is and then change it back to zero. Oh crap. See, now I just screwed myself because I changed it while I was in the air. Yeah, don't do that. Try to avoid that. Frick. Okay, go get it. Okay, anyways, that's how you change your game mode. Um, so, yeah, there's lots of commands, guys. If you want to see the full list of commands, just look on Terminal, um, and on it, it will show you the full list of all of the multiplayer commands that you can do. Uh, there's lots more, you know. Another thing is in that game mode, in the game mode of Creative, you can also do something that's pretty cool. The only reason I don't like creative is because when you're inside creative mode you can't open doors because you just break everything in one hit. Which is good if you're like trying to build something but you know. Again you can't open doors, you can't sleep in your bed, nothing because you just break everything. So, <laughs> don't know your own strength. Uh, yeah, so I'll show you what else you can do in creative mode. And all right, I'm in creative mode. Whoops, nope. <laughs> now that I'm in here, I just press E, like you would normally look in your inventory. So now you have a full list of every item in the game that you can scroll through, and look at. So here's a golden apple. Cool. I want a golden apple. Throw it in there. But then you got to do something with that brick. So you can't look in your inventory. That's another irritating thing about. Uh, creative mode, but yeah, see, golden apple didn't have to do anything to get it, so that's pretty freaking awesome. But I can't cheat, so bye bye golden apple. Okay, and so yeah, that's there's not too much else in here. There's uh. If you type in list, it will show all of the connected players. Right now, I'm the only one connected. So that might be handy if you're running a big server. Um, if you do save on or save off, if you turn save off, um, then you will not be able to save the level when you quit. I like to keep it on. Um, gracefully stops the server it says that's funny okay you can uh, send a private message so a whisper to any player in it just type in the say tell players name and then type in the message um yep give players I already told you that you can TP now this one's very handy but you have to have more than one player playing uh, to do that so I'm right here right now I would just TP myself to uh, any other player in the game. So, yeah, but I'd have to have more than one player playing. Um, you can kick players like that, ban players so they can't join your server again. Um, so yeah, just look through that list, guys. Again, to get that list, type in help, and it'll give you the full list of everything.
So, thanks for watching, guys. Comment, like, subscribe, continue to stay tuned to all of the videos. In the last video, I had a few comments and uh, problems happening uh, because it said that they couldn't connect to the server. I'm guessing that's because they went into multiplayer and it said that can't reach server or something. So, to prevent that, uh, as I said before, you have to have the server open. You have to open start.command. It has to be up, like that. And if it still says it, you press refresh, and there you go. Also, you need to have Hamachi open. So, see my Hamachi is still open, because you can see it. You can see it up here at the top. Let's see, but, um... Yeah, so you have to have that open and powered on. And once you have both those things, then you will be able to connect. So if you have any problems, guys, please leave them in the description below. Uh, again, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We'll be leaving more videos. And uh, see you later, guys.